Maverick Broadcast Network. My name is Aaron Young alongside sports editor Kevin Corbell. As you have watched, just watched the Mavericks lost to the Wrath of the Cougars tonight, dropping their first home game of the year, 81-71, making it five losses in a row for them. For the Mavericks tonight, Taylor Dross led the team with 20 points. As for the Cougars, it was forward Anna Goodhope, who was the top player for the team on the night, scoring 28 points with nine rebounds to go along with it. The Cougars were just too much for the Mavericks tonight. Yeah. Uh, now it's time for the men's basketball team to uh, face the Sioux Falls Cougars in their first game of a four-game homestand for the club. The Mavs have been on a tear as of late, winning their last four, ho- last four games. The team is 11-3 on the year and 7-1 in the NSIC. Sioux Falls, on the other hand, is 10-4 and 5-3 and and in conference play so far this year. The Cougars are coming into this game with a two-game winning streak and look to continue that momentum here tonight. Key players for the Mavericks are junior forward Cameron Kirksey and senior guard Carlos Anderson. Kirksey is averaging 17 points and 5.4 rebounds per game. Anderson is averaging roughly... 12 points and 6.4 rebounds per game. As for Sioux Falls, Trevor (laughs) leads the team in points with 22.9 points and 3.8 rebounds per game. The key for the Mavericks tonight, Kevin, is to start out the game hot Mm -hmm. and limit the amount of points that Evans has for the team. If they can do that, the Mavericks will win comfortably in this one. Indeed, Aaron. It's the second game of two tonight at the Taylor Center as the men's team gets ready to fend off another pack of Cougars tonight. We'll see you guys at the half.